Good morning beautiful souls, happy Monday and the weather's changed in the UK as you can probably see. <clears throat> it's gone from cold and dry to, well, I'm not going to say warm but temperate and very wet. <laughs> so we are two days away from the solstice, the, the shortest day of the year in the northern hemisphere, longest in the south and the point at which the most incredible download of light is coming in. Now, Diana Cooper and I ran a very powerful workshop last night, working with, working with the light that's coming in and also bringing forth the petition to release some of the burdens that, are, that is upon humanity, particularly upon the shoulders of those on the spiritual pathway. So let's just have a little look at that as that is an energy flow that is very prominent for all of us this morning. So we're going to be working with our good friend Lord Katumi from, he runs the Universities of Sirius but he is also the head of a group called the Brotherhood of the Golden Road. Now this consists of both male and female members of all of our light community on earth and also in etheric. Now, many of those that have been wearing the golden robe for this portion of their incarnation are now hanging up the robe and asking that others step forwards and take place. So just have a little tune in this morning. Are you wearing your golden robe or are you stepping forward to take the mantle of it and if neither then absolutely fair enough you'll probably be signed up for something else in the point of service but for for us we're going to be working with Lord Katumi this morning Lord Kathumi so close your eyes and just tune in and breathe into the center of your heart and listen to the wind and the rain all around me and just wherever you are in the world, allow yourself to feel at one with the elements, with the rain, with the wind, with the earth. Maybe you have sunshine, in which case I'm jealous. <laughs> Just breathe and relax. And as you're breathing and relaxing, feel your heart beginning to expand, moving from a ball of white light within the centre of your chest and expanding outwards and outwards until you are cocooned in a beautiful bubble of light. This is your bubble of light, it comes from your heart centre. Breathe and relax and let your heart hold you. Now tune into yourself your bodies and your fields as you're sat within your bubble of light and ask all of the robes or the cloaks or the spiritual geometries that you hold within your bodies and fields to reveal themselves if they are ready. Some of you might be wearing one cloak, some of you might be wearing many and they may be of different colours. So you could be wearing a beautiful aquamarine blue robe associated with the energies of Mother Mary, or you could be wearing a robe of the violet flame, in which case the violet fire is very prominent within your fields. But we're looking for the golden cloak, of the, the brotherhood of the golden robe. So just sense and feel and tune into this. Are you wearing it? It'll be around your shoulders, it'll have a hood very similar to mine and there'll be a clasp around the neck that just gently holds it together so it flows around your body. Now some of these cloaks appear to be hidden by clothes or almost our own personal cloaking device to make sure that what we are doing or what we have taken on has been hidden from view. Allow the cloak to be seen now, allow it to reveal itself. 
And as you were doing this, as you were tuning in, be aware of the presence of Lord Katumi, who himself is standing in front of you with his golden robe on, the hood is up, and you can see his beautiful eyes staring out as they touch your soul. Feel your vibration rising. He is asking you now at this point in time if you are currently a member of the Brotherhood of the Golden Robe, whether you would wish to hand back your robe at this point to be free with gratitude for the service that you have provided. So just take your time to tune into the answer that you are going to give Lord Katumi. If the answer is yes, he will gently unclasp the robe from around your shoulders, take it, fold it gently within his hands and bows with gratitude. And if you are not wearing the robe, you are now being offered the opportunity to don this, to provide assistance for humanity and all of the people around the world that are stepping up. The Golden Robe, or the Brotherhood of the Golden Robe, have collectively taken on together the additional pain and the stresses of humanity as it passes through the denser vibrations. We are no longer in the denser vibrations, so the parameters of the job are changing. The Golden Robe is there to provide support, a support network for other light workers who are stepping up. So just consider for a moment whether you would like to be part of this. And if so, the spiritual benefits are beyond description unless you are in direct communication with Lord Katumi. All will be revealed at a later time. But this is being offered to those of you that might not be doing this job at the moment who may want to. And if you are agreeing to step up, just feel this beautiful golden robe being placed around your shoulders now and the hood being pulled up and you can either wear this brightly with pride or you can just allow it to mute itself slightly so that you can go about your everyday business just doing your job knowing that you are assisting the overall picture of the ascension process for everyone and everything around you. And just breathe and relax. So you are either stepping out of this field at the moment or you are stepping in or you are simply standing and witnessing what is occurring. This is one of the many roles that is occurring and has been occurring all around the world at this moment, both in physical and in etheric. So much is going on. Just spend a few more moments in the presence of Lord Katumi. And then he bows gracefully to you with his hand upon his heart and steps back and heads back to the Sirius Plains where I'm sure he has got much teaching to do. So just allow yourself a few moments more tuning into the beautiful elements that are all around me, the wind, the rain. Allow yourself to feel purified and cleansed, feel your vibration rising. Remember whatever you are personally experiencing at the moment, raise your vibration, breathe into your heart and approach everything from a heart-centered point of consciousness. We are going to experience the most incredible shift 
or change in energy between the solstice and the 1st of January. I know this is said many times, but David Essery and I will be explaining more about this in full detail on our workshop on Wednesday night. So if you want to join David and, us, and myself, the details are in the text of this video. But if not, I shall also be giving a thorough update on Friday. So sending you all lots of love on this very rainy December morning. And um, it's be, it is an absolute pleasure at the moment to be working with Lord Kathumi in whatever capacity is, is being offered. And just like to say well done to all of you if you have decided to step forwards and hand back the golden robe at this time because the particular aspect of the job that we have done has been very very challenging it's been very very tough the golden robe that is being offered now for the next positions is different it's to support it's to provide a dedicated energetic support network for all of the other light workers gone are the days where <clears throat> we are expected to take on so much pain so much suffering that's going on around us the next period of time is about people taking responsibility for their self and their own process and also having a united and supportive network of very high frequency souls all joined together in unity around the world Anyway, that's enough from me. I'm going to go in and get dry and have a cup of coffee. Love you all. See you soon. Bye for now.